fine with Why, it. Why, did somebody say something? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we are down at the local Christian school. It's uh, just coming up for seven o'clock. It's pretty early in the morning. You'll see when the camera goes out, it's, we've got clouds all around. Although it's the middle of summer here, it, uh, it's still warm, but um, wow, we're getting a lot of rain here in Australia. We've had floods up north. But anyway, we're out here this morning to fly the new Hobby Zone Glass Air Sportsman. It's got the virtual instructor. I'm going to use a Mo 2 DX4E that came with it. Let's get on and see how this flies, eh? We'll fly it firstly using the instructor. I'll try and talk us through what's happening while I'm doing it. And then we'll have a fly with it with just being no instructor, just normal and see how she goes. Takes off the grass easy. I've just got to adjust myself now to using the DX4E because I'm used to my DX8. This is a little smaller in my hand, but look, it's flying quite nice. Right, I'm going to turn it really sharp now. It's got the virtual instructor on, see? It, it stops it from stalling. You've still got to fly the plane. It's not going to fly the plane for you. That was hard left rudder. Here we go again. I'll get it up there. Now hard left rudder. There. See, it won't allow the wings to go into that stall. Plenty of time to get it out. Now, this is on low rates. And with the virtual instructor on. Let's bring her around for a slow bye-bye. I can see this being a good learner's plane. As I said, it doesn't fly itself. You'll need to know how to fly a little bit or have an instructor with you. Okay, I'm going to flick her over to high rates now. Let's have a look at high rate. Oh, it'll do a loop. Look at that, that's full hour on it. Won't allow that wing to drop. Here I'll come towards us. There's full right hour on. Look at that, that's full. That's with the virtual instructor on. It makes it a lot slower and easier for you to control it and put the correct command in once it's gone. And as I say, this is on high rates now. As you can see, she's flying around okay. Look at that. Doesn't that look scale? Enough power to get you going. Let's do a loop. Nice big one. Back towards us. And this is with the virtual instructor on. I cannot get it to roll, look at that. That's our ons, left and right, as full as they'll go. It just won't roll, it gives you plenty of time. Okay, now I'm gonna have a fly with the virtual instructor off. Now we'll see the difference. Okay, here's full hour on. Whoa, she goes right over it. It's like flying a normal plane. So let's bring her around. A loop. No worries. Nice big. Flies very nice. Let's see how she lands, shall we? Right, I'm going to put the virtual instructor back on and put her back to low rates. And we'll come in for a landing now. Here we go. You've got the tricycle gear, so it should be fairly easy. I've cut the throttle now, just bringing her down. Look at that. Beautiful. Here she comes again. Well, as you can see, she handles the grass all right. I'm enjoying that. I'm going to stick her on high rates. I'm going to stick the virtual instructor off and go again.
I'm sure those who aren't learners who want to turn this plane into a nice scale plane will be able to do so no worries because it flies really nice. This is very stable, this plane. I've got hardly any throttle on there, just cruising it around nicely. Okay, I don't know how long I've been. I've got no timer on this uh, radio. I didn't think about that, but I'm sure we better come down. So we'll just go round and we'll land. Here she comes. There we have it, the glass air. My hobby zone with the virtual instructor flies pretty good. I still wouldn't recommend it for the first plane you've ever had unless you've got someone to help you. But um, you've still got to fly it, but that virtual instructor you saw, when I was giving it full left or right hour on, it only allows it to go like this. It won't allow it to drop that wing right down. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this little uh, review and maiden of the hobby zone and uh, we'll see you next time. Catch us all.